Hey guys, welcome to my channel. I come to do um, a reading for Tarsus. That's dealing with a Virgo. Tarsus is dealing with a Virgo. Spirit, give me what I need for Tarsus is dealing with a Virgo. Tarsus is dealing with a Virgo. All right, let's see what's going on. Give me one my shuffle, Spirit. Tarsus is dealing with a Virgo. Okay, let's see. All right, you got the Page of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck. Okay. Okay, Tarzan is dealing with a Virgo. Spirit, give me what I need. Hmm, that's too many. Tarzan is dealing with a Virgo, Spirit. Okay, somebody got a lot to say. I can tell you that much. Okay, so you got the All uh, Lovers and you have the World card with the Page of Cups. Let's see. Let's get some more messages. What up, Spirit? All right, you got the Four Wands. I'm sorry, the Four Swords. You got uh, the, the Death card. This is Taurus in a Virgo. Taurus in a Virgo. Ace of Pentacles. Let me get one more spirit. Taurus in a Virgo. The devil is in reverse. Hmm. Okay. So, at the bottom of the deck, you got the King of Pentacles, the Ace of Cups, and the Sun. Hmm, I think I'm gonna keep that because the way I see this reading, what I see right now, this person is letting go of addictions, habits, bad thoughts. Um, They're healing. They're definitely healing because something came to an end and they went through a major transformation. This really looked like the dark night of the soul. I ain't gonna even lie because you got the hermit energy here as well. Okay, this is, this is uh, Virgo. Okay, you got the King of Pentacles. Okay, so what I'm seeing is this person uh, need they they they're definitely still in this healing energy. Okay, um, contemplating on what their next move is going to be, and if they're gonna they they got an offer that's coming or and an apology most likely. Okay, and you got the Ace of Pentacles here with the Ace of Cups, the Sun, and the King of Pentacles. Okay, this person is in this hermit energy right now. Okay. And um, they're going through this transformation. Oh, yeah. They're going through a, a, bit, a, a major transformation. Spirit, give me what I need. Yeah. You got the Ten of Wands. Okay. They've been carrying a heavy load. Yeah. And it still might be. Okay. Why they're going through this transformation. Because a lot of things had to, had to end. Mm -hmm. They got a lot of mental conflict. Or had a lot of mental conflict. And they got uh, the Page of Pentacles. Um, something, uh, I think they want to come and give you an offer, a, 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 a truce. Okay. But the, eventually, okay. This is nothing that's coming in fast because this person is still healing. What up spirit? Mm -hmm. You got the 10 of cups, you know, tens of endings and tarot. So this person might've left for a family dynamic. Okay. And they make making a judgment to come towards their wish fulfillment, which is you. Okay, take a how it resonate. You know who you are in this. Okay, Taurus dealing with a Virgo. Okay, but the good thing about this is this this devil in this person is letting go that de of that devil energy. Mm hmm. That is so good. Okay, so let this person do what they do, honey. But I do see love. I do see happiness. I do see stability, loyalty. Look, there y'all go right there. The King and the Queen of Pentacles. Mm hmm. <laughs> Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. So one of y'all Taurus, one of y'all Virgo. Okay. Wow. This is your this is your twin. This is your soulmate. This is your divine counterpart. But is this what ended? It might have something might have ended between y'all and they coming back around because they had you somebody cut. Yep, somebody cut them off and they was in a lot of regret. Mm-hmm. For losing you. And now they gotta make up their mind. Yeah, they're making up their mind. They, 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 they're making a judgment to uh, resurrect the situation with you. 
They, they don't let go of this devil energy, so get them a chance. Well, I can't tell you what to do. <laughs> Look, they, they but they won't be coming in with no more devil energy. They're working on that right now. That's why they're healing. You got the Ace of Wands, and you got the Nine of Pentacles, okay? Somebody's single. Mm -hmm, definitely, definitely somebody is single. All right, let's get some more... Um, Let's get some more cards and see what else is going on. All right. Somebody could take a relationship or not. Somebody doing very good on their own right now. Okay. Take it how it resonated. It could be you or the other person, but I think it's you. You're doing very good on your own. And this person want to come back because they're full of regret for losing you. Okay. You are their wish fulfillment. You are their, their the soulmate. You are their soulmate. You know, they need to make up their mind what they're going to do. Okay? They probably, they, y'all probably were, were in a family, y'all probably was in a family dynamic together. Mm-hmm. And if not, you will have a family, you, you and this person will have a family with, with each other because this person, this person want to come in eventually. This is a, uh, I'm trying to figure out if this is new. This is a new cycle in love. That's what I'm picking up. And if you haven't met this person, this is your twin that's coming towards you. Let me just put that out there. But the Wheel of Fortune is here. And the Ace of Pentacles. You and this person going to have a lot of money, stability, loyalty. Okay? Y'all, this is going to be a lot of happiness in this relationship because by them putting this, this devil energy down and these addictions and attachments and... All that other stuff that they've been dealing with. This is going to be a great relationship, okay? Yeah, this person this person know they lost a good thing if this is what happened. Okay, let's see. They, they go to Virgo at the bottom of the deck, and you got the Ace of Cups with the Knight, <laughs> the Knight of Swords, and the Nine of Cups, okay? This is wish fulfillment that's coming in pretty fast. Somebody coming in with some messages really, really fast. But this person still is in this hermit energy seeking, they're getting downloads directly from spirit. They see, they're seeking. They're getting a lot of answers. This is Virgo energy. Mm-hmm. Yeah. They're healing. What else, spirit? Oh, yeah, they're healing. You got the Ace of Cups. This is clarifying the Ace of Cups that was at the bottom and the Hermit. Mm-hmm. Let's see. You got the Queen of Pentacles again, okay? Wow. So this is this is this is looking pretty good. Something coming full circle, and not only that, money is gonna be great. You got stability. You got money. <laughs> yeah, somebody's walking to, back to somebody's walking towards. I don't know. If, let me, give me a second. Let me see. Eight of cups. Let's see. Three of cups. Let me get one more spirit. Clarify this. Eight of cups. Yep. Somebody's walking towards their wish. This is a wish. This is wish fulfillment. This Ace of Cups, somebody's walking towards this Three of Cups, okay? And this Three of Cups is nine times out of ten an engagement, okay, a celebration. And I'm not, I'm just going to put it out there. It is what it is. You got the Sun. You got the Ace of Cups twice. You got the Three of Cups. These are pregnancy cards as well. Mm-hmm. So, you might want to look out for that as well. <laughs> Mm-hmm. All right. You got the hangman. This person still is in this hangman mode because they're still in this hermit energy. This spirit got them suspended because they're still working out this energy right here. Mm-hmm. They're getting all that mess out of them so they can come in with this ten of cups. Mm-hmm. Yeah. The ten of swords. They're coming out of that hurt energy. Mm-hmm. It's in reverse. The ten of swords is in reverse. They 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 coming out of that energy so they can come towards you and have something stable, stable, committed, loving, happy family, happy wife, children, <laughs> very grounded. Y'all love each other. Y'all 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 get along very well. Okay, this is a this is this is a great connection. Okay, I'm feeling very good about this. You got the chariot. They're gonna be coming in fast. Okay. Um, right now you're single, you're doing your thing, but at the end of the day, you're not going to be single for long when this person come in. Yeah. Cause they're coming in with this page of pentacles offer. Like, give me a few more spirit. Uh-huh. Look, they got a lot of love for you. Ah, ah, 
had. They may not express it, but they do. Look, you got the um, Ace of Pentacles, the Ace of Cups, and the Ace of Wands. Listen, this is this is a, a, a great connection, and that's all I'm going to say, okay? This is a great connection. A lot of, a lot, a lot of stability. Not only stability, a lot of understanding with each other. A lot of, um, gosh, just... Y'all just go together. <laughs> like, y'all supposed to be together. That's what I'm picking up. And this person don't want to lose you because at the end of the day, they know they're not going to be able to find this anywhere else. You got wedding rings, okay? Union marriage, soul connection, okay? This person say not today, and that spirit saying not today because this person is still working out that devil energy now, and you know it came out in reverse. Now, if they was dealing with somebody else, they say the other woman look over your shoulder, but we ain't worried about that because they're done with that. You got heartbroken, you got cut down, separation. Y'all probably was separated, but now um, they're coming in with this passion. Mm hmm. Whoever they, whoever they was dealing with, they cut them down. <laughs> and the relate and their relationship that they was in with whoever this other person was, or uh, the snake, is done. The relationship is over. No second chances. You don't have to worry about this person. Yes, they might. The person who they let go, you might have to. You know, like they might still be dealing with some energies from that. But for the most part, you ain't. You don't have nothing to worry about. This person is letting that person go. Mm -hmm, that's what they letting go. Mm -hmm, this was a toxic karmic relationship. That's what. It, that's exactly what it was. Mm -hmm. You're gonna get a love call from them, and it's gonna shock you. Mm -hmm. So let them finish. Let them finish healing. Yeah, they separate. Yeah, they're done. But they they missing you now. Okay, they're thinking about you. Now they're ready for you because y'all been separated too long. Mm -hmm. I'm not gonna lie, y'all. Virgos and Taurus is getting along very well. I just gotta just put that out there. <laughs> so it is. It's a bittersweet relationship when you get a bad Virgo or a bad Taurus. I'm not going to lie, but even in the bad, I'm not going to even lie. Them, them Virgos are some very smart people. I'm just going to put it out there like that. It is what it is. Okay. Y'all mirroring each other. <laughs> um, okay. You got the dragonfly. Give me a few more spirit. Okay, and you got Paradise and Cupid's Arrow. See, this person, they they sabotaged this, but they're coming back, okay? And they're coming back with this love. Have faith. Love is coming, okay? Um, Paradise, enjoying each other, okay? Honeymoon phase, pretty much. Not honeymoon phase. Yeah, honeymoon phase, okay? Enjoying each other. They're ready to rebuild this relationship, and you got love, and there go the money right there. Soulmate. Listen, it, it is what it is. It will ascend to a higher level, okay? Just give this person some time. Let them finish. Let them finish going through this devil energy, honey, because that devil energy is real, okay? And um, when when you have a, again, when you get a bad Virgo or a bad Taurus, you really got to let them work through their issues because it's a lot of stubbornness, okay? A lot of all in your head thinking it's your way or the highway and that you're always right. Mm -mm. that's not what this is okay so this is Taurus dealing with a Virgo spirit give me what I need make the effort okay this person will be making the effort okay y'all got a new phase in love okay or this is a new love take it how it resonates this could be a new love or a new phase in love so you might have a Virgo coming to you who knows or Taurus coming to you attraction you attract romantic uh, love by enjoying this moment fully okay you have um, forgiving and learning, okay? So you got to forgive this person. And it's a very soon. I do. I feel like it's very soon, okay? This person need to let go of control issues. And um, let's see. Give me a few more spirit. Yeah, they need to let go of control issues. Because, you know, stubbornness. Stubbornness. It takes somebody, it takes somebody to call earth signs out. Because we be so stubborn in our um, thinking. And we always think we're right, but we don't be. <laughs> Okay, so let's see what's going on. What else, spirit? Okay, children. Okay, um, your love life is uh being affected by children. So this person might got children by somebody else. Okay, but you got passion, you got trust, you got reconciliation, and spirit wants you to know that um it was unrequited love in that other in that karmic relationship that they were in, and this unrequited love made them revert back to you. Because they know that you are the one. 
okay? And again, y'all just go. It's a lot of stability. It's a lot of it's a it's a lot of good equal give and take when you dealing with another earth sign, especially a Virgo. I'm just gonna put it out there, okay? I love you guys, and I'll talk to you soon. This is for Taurus that's dealing with a Virgo.